At first, it was fine. They supplied us with raw materials we manufactured and sold the weapons. Then, three years ago, Zimmerman hired some mercenaries to help protect Andy Temp from the Death Claws and the odd random attack by raiders. Those regulators are cold-hearted bastards and they are squeezing us for all we have. We make the guns and they get rich off of us. Why don't you just leave and set up somewhere else? We would if we could, but moving a major under would be a major undertaking with all the laths and mills. These are things that aren't just picked up e and easily moved. We could move, but the death cannot make it impossible. You guys seem fairly well armed. Why don't you go exterminate them? We've gone over there and taken out a few, but they always seem to come back. Besides, we're mechanists, not fighters. What would you give me if I went in there and took care of them for you? If you could get rid of the death gods once and for all, you could name your price. I have some friends who could really use your weapons. Who do we need? Who needs their weapons? can't quite think of them. Shady Sands, I guess? My vault could use weapons to defend themselves. Oh, maybe the blades. Maybe if I side with the blades. I have some friends who could really use your weapons. You clear out the death claws, all of them, you got yourself a deal. I have to think about it, my friend. But yeah, I have loads of ammo that I got from the gun runners. A whole bunch of small energy cells. Got the ripper and got the cattle prod. What's the difference? Ripper does 15 to 34. Well, let me see if she will use the cattle prod. But we're here at the Gunrunner's main base. And we've made a deal with them that if we can clear out the death claws, we will get weapons for our friends. I'm hoping that is for the vault. What's this here? That body. So it looks like he has a vault jumpsuit, no? Oh well, let's get back to Andy Tem. Let's avoid the death pods by all means possible. Go in and talk to the Blades leader. Maybe she'll want to buy the weapons off me. You're the leader of this gang. But you look like a gang to me. I wish we were a gang, at least then we'd be ever. We'd have decent weapons to defend ourselves. Defend yourselves from what? We need better weapons. Gun runners a little ways from here have weapons, but we can't get to them. Why can't you? There's a death clock cam. Nest between us and them, and we have never even spoken with any of the gun runners. The regulars have the firepower to clear out the death clouds, but they don't for some reason. Where can I find the gun runners located? This seems like, yes, I can either kill the survivors or I can clear out the regulators. I don't think I, it's beneficial to do either one right now. Back to the hub. Take the long way around, see if we can get a random encounter. What if we go back to Necrom. Or Necropolis. Oh, the bulls are dead. Shit. Everyone is dead. I guess. Oh. Maybe I'm responsible for this, if I'm honest. They ran out of water and just died. Well, I guess I'll go through and loop. 
how much else I can do for them. See who else is alive. Maybe I can save a few people. I don't know why the feral ghouls would be dead because of that. I didn't think they drank water. Or do they give the feral ghouls water? This place gives me the creeps. Oh, they're dead. Yeah. Oh well. I guess ghouls aren't as resistant to dehydration as I thought they would be. Looks like my actions have made this place into a complete ghost town. Are even the glowing ones dead? Yeah, it's just everyone's dead here. Locked. Nice. Oh. A fridge shotgun. I like their style. Well, that seems to be all. Let's get back down in the sewers. Hey, that wall with a tear in it in the password looks like it could move. I think it's trapped, so I'm not going to move it. What do we have in here? Another shotgun. Okay, that's about all. Let's continue searching. Let's see if the super mutants are still here. Maybe I could try to kill them. Does it look like the super mutants are here anymore? Are they also dead? Guess there's nothing else for me to do in the Acropolis. The only people living are the children of the cathedral. And they don't feel safe here because... I don't know, maybe they're... Super mutant overlords are gone. Or maybe they don't feel safe because the ghouls are gone. Either way, we're heading back to the hub. Hopefully we can get there in time for a martyr, water merchant run. You see a bookcase. You search a bookcase. Oh look, some ammo. Doesn't seem like there's much else here. We arrive at the hub just in time to do the, the water merchant's caravan. Good. You got the okay. I knew it wouldn't be a problem. So what's the pay? Our pays 200 hub bucks. It's not that great, but we go out often and our roots aren't too dangerous. And yes, like everyone else, that is for each way. But of course, you don't have to do both ways. Are you interested? Sure. Outstanding. Pay will be 200 hub bucks. Which route would you like to take? Let's go for the junk town route. Wow, that really hit me. Acha is just bugged at this point. I don't know what to do with her. Maybe I just need to take the cattle prod from her. She can't even have another weapon in her inventory that she can't use. Gotcha. Okay, so we're here outside the water merchants. Gonna 
do one of the caravan missions, I guess. Good, you got the pay. What's the pay? 200 bucks there and back. Your thing. Truth, would you prefer? Let's go junk town. Outstanding. I'll get the rest of the crew. Damn, critically hit by an insect. And rip you now because of that. Ripped. That's gonna be my new cash phrase. Get ripped. Getting the level too perfect. That's just what we need. I'm gonna sink it all into energy weapons. I think that's probably the way to do it. So we we just need to be combat effective. Level 8, barely. Let's continue. Let me find this up for caravan route. Well, here we are. Here's your pay, 200 caps. He pulls out an old dog-eared money bag and gives you the money. You'll get another 200 caps if you return with us. To the hub. We'll rest for a while, but don't go too far, or the caravan will leave without you. How long before it leaves? You should leave two hours after arrival. There's nothing here we haven't seen before. So if you want to leave earlier, we're ready whenever you are. I think I'll take a look around before I go. See you later. It's nighttime though. I can't really do much. Now yeah, we can go. I'm ready. Hey, we made it. Didn't even fight anything. Good little caps for you. If you want more work, just go talk to the boss again. I'd be more than happy to work with you. I'll put in a good word for you with a boss. Take it easy. Take it easy, my friend. Okay, so we've completed our first water merchant caravan. That wasn't too bad. It's March 10th. So I can go to another one instantly. Oh, it takes five days. Cool. Let's just go do another one. We're just going to grind levels. Quickly see if the merchants have restocked. Well, Mitch has money again, so I'm going to go and sell all my goods. And I'll go back down to the water merchants. It's time for another water merchant caravan mission. Let's do it. Let's go to the LA Boneyard this time. Check out the different routes. Down the way. Good job, dog meat. Oh, don't clean up on dog meat. Good job. Picked up his spear and threw it again. Or actually stabbed him this time. Give me all your money. Let's continue to the junkyard. Boneyard. What can you tell me about the boneyard? This part of the boneyard is called Andy Town. The boneyard is basically run by gangs. Kind of a rough area, so watch your step here. Andy Tum is run by regulators. They're trying to hold this place together in light of all of all the going wars. They're understandably suspicious of strangers, so if you haven't spoken to them yet, I suggest you do before you, you start wandering around. Do you actually sell anything? How long before it leaves? Let's get back to the hub. I don't want to see anything here. So, I've decided I want to go down and check out the trader with the children of the cathedral. On the way, I'll pass by the boneyard and see if I can buy a second ripper for Katya. Gunrunners didn't end up having the ripper. But either way, I sold my gear and I'm going to continue down to the cathedral. Okay, that's a good trade. Why is that? I refuse to deal with those with weapons. Okay, let me holster it. I forgot the way he traded with me, so it doesn't really matter. 
not sure who to talk with here, so I'm just going to continue along my way. I believe it's time I make my way down to the glow. See if I could manage to continue with the story. To the glow it is. And go around the water. Location the glow crater. What the hell happened here? Okay, first things first, I was warned about radiation. I'm gonna check out my current radiation. I'm also gonna take some Radex. Where the hell is my backpack? I left my backpack someplace. Oh no, that's not good. I think I know where I left it, so I'll play and then go look for it. Hopefully I can make it without Radex. Take some Radex. Does this work? Anti-radiation came to be taken before exposure. No known side effects. Guess I'll take Rad away too. We lost 23 Rads. Use my Geiger counter. I have three rads. Okay, that's fine. Oh, you know what? I may need a rope. I don't have a rope. Pretty sure I saw a rope at the boneyard. You see a door. Geiger counter's off. You see a couple of people out fishing. My friend. Howdy, sir. I don't offer I don't often see strangers in this spot. Is there something I could do for you? How's the fishing? Well I've been I've fished this place for the last five years and it keeps getting worse and worse. I think it's skunk. The three eyed giant catfish that keeps scaring everyone away from my spot. But I'm gonna get that fish. Just you wait. It's getting personal between us. The only one of us, only one of us is going to walk away. Believe me, I'm more serious than the Brotherhood of Steel about this. Anyhow, I need quiet for my fishing, so I'd appreciate if you keep quiet and let me get back to work before my boy starves. See a barrel. You can read the label. Keep your city streets clean. No man's ever called me inhospitable, but I don't want to repeat what a woman call me. I'm trying to fish and I need absolute quiet to catch a damn thing, so please try to keep quiet. I'm looking for some info. What do you want to talk about? I tried to find out about mutant armies. Mutant armies? Just plain armies would be bad enough. I heard tell that someone's been harassing the ghouls over in Necropolis, but that was a while ago. Okay, my friend. Good luck with your fishing. Hey, we can head down. Oh, is this a vault? Of these stack. I'm gonna use a second one. I have more than enough. 78 rads. Probably not much left here. That. This guy has a hollow tape. A yellow key pass. What is here? The computer system power management power system management primary power offline reinitialize primary power emergency power online disable emergency power um no how about we enable emergency power aims of a woman assault rifle and milk pistol Rats don't seem to be going up. Rad X and Rad away, interesting. Let's hit for five points. There's mines around. Dock from electrical field? Yeah. Can I... Repair?
Not repair that. Okay. Play downloading data. I think it may be what the Brotherhood sent you to retrieve. Okay. If that's all the Brotherhood wanted, let's get out of here before my face melts off. I had to leave this hellhole. Wish I had a hot dog and a really long stick. <laughs> so you can roast it over the radiation. Okay, so we're heading back to the hub, aren't we? Just gonna quickly sell my gear at the hub and I'll head over to the Brotherhood of Steel. I've sold my gear here at the hub, so let's head on over to the Brotherhood. See what they have to say. Hello, Paladin. Hey, you're back. Did you get something? You sure did. But um, the High Elder said you have to give it to me before I can let you. This is great. Hang on while I open the door. You're now an, an initiate with the Brotherhood of Steel. Good day, Initiate. How may I help you? Look at their legs. They're looking mighty fine. What time should I pick you up? What? You tell me well, where to find our High Elder. Maxim, the hey, High Elder, can be found in the, on the fourth floor. If you take the other elevator down to level four, four he should be either in the council room or the elders room. Thank you. Actually, I should ask them where I could find some better equipment. I'll find it eventually. Hello, you must be the outsider initiate. Nice to meet you. What can I do for you? How do I get better weapons and equipment? In a hurry, are we? As initiate, you're entitled to a few things. I put a clearance for combat armor and three orders of ammunition bullets of your choice. Just see Michael in the next room for the supplies. Thank you, what about some high tech weapons? Hmm, I don't know. You may have to prove yourself to be an initiate, but that doesn't mean we start handing over weapons to someone that might not be qualified, especially an outsider. No offense. I really need some better firepower. You built quite a lot of reputation for yourself. The people I've checked with hold you in high regards. I don't think you need any help. You seem quite capable. However, if you help me with a little problem, I might be able to reward you with something. Sure, what's the problem? I sent one of our initiates out to the hub a short while back and we haven't heard back from him. If you can find out what happened to him, I'd be very grateful. Sure thing, I'll check it out. Thank you, I'll remember this. When I've seen that you are gonna gain enough experience, I might be able to give you something special for our order. From our order. Ed Bundy, Brotherhood of Steel member. Who would have thought it? I was wondering. Awkward. Some members of the Brotherhood might be offended if a stranger, I mean a new initiate, approaches them with a weapon. Well, I'm gonna choose to believe that's why this guard here attacked me. Either that, or they really protect their locked doors. Have anything to say, my friend? Hello, brother. How can I help you? Please excuse me for asking, but what do you do for our Brotherhood? Oh, nothing quite as glorious as our Paladins. I just run the supply room, checking equipment and other supplies to other people. I'd like to check something out. How do I do that? You need to have the proper authorization. Only specific people can give you authorization to check out items from the supply room. Okay, thanks. Who do I need to talk to then? Well, there are quite a few people actually, but... 
Talos is a person you should probably talk to. You might also want to check with Math Tia. She might be able to help you too. Where can I find Math Tia? Math Tia is Maxon's assistant. She's technically the High Elder's assistant, but she works with all the other elders. She is normally in the elders' room. That's located on the fourth floor. I will tell us. Tell us. He's in the training room to our left. Ah, thanks. I already spoke to him. Two for sale. Where's your doctor located? She's on the second level. Just go down to the second floor. Make a left. You'll see it just past the learning room. I should get back to work if you have any questions to ask. I actually do have one more question. Can I get more ammo? Sorry. You've had more than your share for this week. Okay, so he'll give me more ammo later, I guess. Do you have something you want to sell me? I guess I'll check that later since the door closed in my face. Go talk to this guy. Hopefully he doesn't kill me because I walk up with a rope in my hand. Oh, that reminds me. I'm going here. Not get there. Anything I can take? May I help you? Oh, my friend. Can I ask you a few questions? Can you give me some history behind the Brotherhood? Dr. Vree in the main library. Will do. Pretty good rumors? I do not put stock in rumors. Oh, come on. Just one, please. No. Come on, pretty please. Do you not hear? I will not say it again. Okay, I'll leave you to yourself. Oh. All right. Explain yourself, initiate. Sorry, I didn't know this was your room. Then leave, and I will forget this little incident. Thank you, Paladin. I don't think the Paladin likes me very much. Okay. So they don't want me in their private areas right now. I guess I have to gain their trust. It makes sense, after all. Let's go down to the second floor. Slowly make our way down to the fourth. There's one thing I wanted to check out. My archives. That is Ancient Brotherhood Tape. Captain Maxon was right. This place is a death trap. I'm writing this so that we don't make it back. Someone someday might, if we don't make it back, someone someday might find out what happened to us. We made it to the West Tech Research Facility after 28 days of hell. But that was the easy part. The radiation levels began to shoot up as soon as we could see the giant crater. We checked our supplies and figured with our armor and our anti-rat supplies, we'd be fine for at least a day of exploring. We felt it was a calculated risk, but the technology we had the potential to recover was worth it. We climbed down the crater to the first level and everything seemed to be according to plan. Power was off, so we didn't need to circumvent security. Or so we thought. There wasn't much of value on this level, so we pushed on. The second level was more of the same. When Jensen dropped to the third level, all hell broke loose. The security sensors had been burned out the first two levels, but not on the third. Jensen was cut to ribbons before he knew what had happened. We'd never seen weapons cut through power armor like that. Men started dropping right and left, and the ones that were still alive lost it. I tried to regroup, but only Soto and Camarillo made it back here to the first level with me. The fact that I can smell Soto's burning flesh where his arm was taken off means that my power armor is no longer airtight. So I'm sucking up a lot more rads than I had planned. I'm leaking hydraulics at an alarming rate. We need to get far enough away from this place before my armor dies. Amarillo seems fine physically, but he wandered off about an hour ago, mumbling something about 
get hit in the, the bastard has all the anti-rad 